Well, good morning. Hello, everybody. We are on our way to the date we've been waiting for for quite a while. We're on our way to Mayberry for our meetup with all of our YouTube channel friends. We're currently just north of Charlotte, North Carolina on 77. And uh, we have about just under two hours to go. We'll see everybody there. Yep. I'm going to start to question whether or not we were oh. where we thought we were supposed to be. And there it is. Maybe we're campground. Hi everybody, I'm Diana. And I'm Brad. And we're It's About Time Now. Brad and I want to welcome you back to the channel. And if this is your first time here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. We want to thank YouTube channels Camper Life and New Horizons who set up this meetup. And a special thanks to Johnny's Journeys and Vanderella for hosting the great get togethers at their sites and so much more. We got to hang out with great people from super channels like Blue Wave Odyssey, RV Underway, One Strange Adventure, Nursing Our Travel Bug, Forever Best Friends, The Art of RVing, Traveling Down the Bannisters. And so many more. You know, we were talking about you earlier. You know what we enjoy about you? You're not afraid to make a complete total fool of yourself. That is what makes you so good. Thank you. And we're here at the Mayberry Meetup. Um, outside with, of Mount Airy. Outside of Mount Airy, North Carolina. Uh, with, uh, I think we've got about 20 other YouTube channels here with us. And everybody's just having a wonderful time. And today was the uh, potluck picnic. So. We've had a full belly and great conversations, and uh, come along with us. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is very special. That is amazing. Meant to be our being. Captain Jack. Traveling down to Bannister. Yay! Hi, so who are you? Hi, I'm Natasha. And I'm Bill. And we're Nursing Our Travel Bug. Why did you start RV? You know, I had an epiphany one day. Our daughter was nine. And I, I realized she was already halfway to leaving me. And I wanted to figure out a way to keep my children close. And I met some people who were getting into travel nursing. And then we did research of other families RV. And we thought, we could do this. And why not? We're young, we're healthy, let's get out and let's do it while we can. What has been your greatest learning experience. So we've been on the road three and a half years. Our biggest learning experience is to only trust each other when like backing into a spot or pulling into a tight space. Because if somebody else helps you and you rip up your roof twice, oh, no. oh, that's not you're good. the ones that are going to pay for it. <laughs> Alright, last question then. So in your three and a half years of travel, what was the most amazing place that you have been to? I loved the Black Hills of South Dakota. I don't know, it just felt, I felt like one with nature. I felt, I felt my creator there. It was just really powerful. So I really loved the Black Hills. And do you guys have a tagline that you use? We do. So I'm Natasha. And I'm Bill. With Nursing Our Travel Bug, encouraging you to nurse what makes you happy. So who are you guys? I'm Rocky, and that's Aaron. Yeah. RV Kids TV. What's your channel about? It originally started out as us transitioning to full-time RVing and uh, with our children, and now it's transitioning into us, just our trips, where we're at, what we're doing, and so everybody can join along with us. What do you hope to be your main goal in full-time? Uh, since we're homeschooling our children, uh, that's sort of our driving factor is places to visit so that our children can hands-on experience the history, uh, hands-on experience all of the states and learn through that way versus just a traditional book, reading out of a book. That's great. That's that is great. good. Yeah. 
Yes, that's good right. family time. Yes, yeah, yeah that's Making amazing. Memories. Do you have a tagline? Sign off is normally if you're traveling, be safe. If you're not traveling, be safe, but most importantly, God bless. Okay, so who are you? I'm Ricky. And I'm Barbara. And where do you hail and from? We're RV underway. Where do you hail from? Hailburg, Alabama. Alabama. And you're part time or full time? We are any timers. Any time. That's what we need. See? That's exactly <laughs> what, That's beautiful. We're going to steal that. You don't mind, do you? No, we go right awesome. ahead. Copyright copyrighted. Sure. We get a little cut back for do you? it. Do you? That's oh, amazing. Actually, I think we stole it from somebody. How, <laughs> we, how long we have you guys We plagiarized everything been? like everybody else. Yeah. <laughs> how long have you guys been RVing? Two years. Two years? Just two years. We've only had Matilda two years now. Two years, and uh, this is the longest trip she has ever made from home, and which is, it'll be about a 1,200 miles round trip when we're done. Or let's go 2021. What's your plan for that? 2021, we, we pray that there is a meetup out in Colorado that's going to head west. And it's uh, kind of in the planning stages right now, but her family is from Colorado Springs. Yes. And we want to see Jerry from uh, Happy Place Diaries and meet up with them and drive out toward Oregon. What do you feel is one of the most important aspects of the RV community? The family, the camaraderie. Oh my goodness, we miss that. We're both the uh, Navy, and when we were on active duty, we had that camaraderie with your command, and you made uh, lifelong friendships. You've been missing that, just our nine to five jobs. It wasn't filling that void, and, and here we are now with uh, true family and friends. Oh. And we look forward to meeting them. We look forward to seeing them on YouTube. We look forward to hearing from them in email and in text messages and phone calls. It's the camaraderie. And it's been great. It's been a real pleasure to meet you in person. Rick. Pleasure Absolutely. to get to know you too. All right. Absolutely. Now you have a tagline, an ending? Yeah, we do. Until we see you again, fair winds and following seas. So who are you guys? I'm Fabian. And I'm Becky. And we are proceeding onward in America. POA. Are you full time or part time? Full time RVers. Full time RVers. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been full time? A little uh, over two and a half years. Over two and a half years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so, in your two and a half years of full timing, what would you say is the greatest lesson that you've learned? Don't always trust the Google map on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> and have patience. Everything changes. Even if you have all the plans in the world, it can change on you. And don't. Well, yeah, your plans never stay the same. <laughs> Gotta be Gumby. <laughs> Gotta be Gumby. Absolutely. What would you say then was the one place you've been that was on your bucket list that you had to go? That would probably be Washington. Washington State? Yep. Oh yeah, gotta love that. What are your plans going forward into 2021? What are the plans in 2021? Well, we got a lot of plans for 2021. <laughs> we'll be work camping. We'll be doing um, hopefully some upgrading. So I'm going to ask you then, what is it that you always like to say when you sign off? Uh, keep proceeding onward in your adventures. Until next time. Bye bye. We're getting out RV adventures with the choir. I'm Scott. There's no more filming the camera. I'm Chloe and I'm Carrie. You guys full time or part time? We are part time. Part -time. We're brand new to this. We started um, during the pandemic, so we've only been going just a few months. So far, where have you been? Gatlinburg, Cherokee, Cherokee, North Carolina. That's the other side of the. Yeah. We've pretty much traveled South Carolina, North Carolina, Virginia, and Tennessee. Oh, that's great. I mean, oh, not like the whole state. But that's that awesome. We did a Smoky Mountain trip this year, our own self. Yes. So, what is your plan going into 2021 then? Over the summer, we were traveling tons. Carrie could uh, work from home. I'm a teacher, so I didn't. I was able to go for the summer. But now that they're back in school, we've had to really scale back and figure out when do we have available time to travel. So. 2021, they're going to tell them what might happen. We're sort of winging it and trying to see what opportunities come up and go when we're able, then we have to stay close to home. I love it. That's our theory. Be Gumby. Be Gumby. Yeah. Gumby, yes. You know, that's, what we, that's what we say. Semper Gumby. Always flexible. Semper Gumby. <laughs> I love it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Tagline? A finisher? <laughs> our finisher is bye. bye. <laughs> love it. Perfect. <laughs> Uh-oh, here we go. <laughs>
<laughs> I got something to ask you. So, oh, easy, brother. <laughs> easy, easy, man. So, on your last stream, why didn't you read what I told you? Huh? Huh? Why didn't you read it? I didn't read it. She was supposed to read it. Said the animal. Did you see that in the joke book? I see when you were talking about Barbara, huh? Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. I got business down here. Uh, yeah, Diana. Yeah, yeah exactly. Quit talking to me. Hey, guys, are you afraid of dogs? Dogs? Well, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> guys well that's it here from beautiful Mount Airy North Carolina and the Mayberry meetup we certainly hope you guys have enjoyed this one and uh, we certainly did it was great yep if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and remember it's about time now because tomorrow is not guaranteed bye guys oh this is very pretty